and welcome to City A Go Go, coming to you this month from Owajamaya, a cool and exotic Asian market located in the International District. Well, man, oh mighty, do we have a good show for you? So let's get to it. I think I'm drawn to painting because of color. First up, the whimsical world of painter Bobby Baker. I started painting as an adult in the last five or six years. I think because I don't have any formal training, I think that actually kind of works as an advantage for me. I'm doing these landscapes, but I think I could almost be painting anything because for me it's just, it's about color and it's about shape. They all seem to be about a journey. You know, they have a river, or a road, or a path that leads through them. One of the comments that I often hear from people is that uh, they'd like to go there. They'd like to go to that place. I feel like they're, they're good places, you know. They're, they're warm, and they're inviting, and they're safe. This show is called Dinosaurs of Darkness, and it's about dinosaurs that were found in the high polar latitudes in Australia, in New Zealand, in Antarctica, and in the north slopes of Alaska. At that time, the continents were not the same as they are today. The continents were at very high latitudes. Although there was less ice than there is now, there was still winter, and it got dark for four or five months of every year. Some of these dinosaurs have very big eyes, some of them, so they can see in the dark. Some of them clearly um, did not hibernate. They lived all the way through this dark time and could eat and maintain themselves. There are ferns, there are fir trees, pine trees. There were a lot of things for these animals to eat. People should want to come because they are whole dinosaurs. We have full dinosaurs big dinosaurs that are very exciting, things that we really very rarely see around Washington. And we have the real fossils as well. They come from areas that we're never going to go to, Antarctica, North Slope of Alaska. It's all very new and different. And now for the details. One, two, three, four. Check out Bobby Baker's beautiful paintings now through August 8th at Cafe Flora. Call 325-9100 for restaurant hours. Get up close and personal with those Dinos of Darkness at the University of Washington's Burke Museum now through October 10th. More information is at burkemuseum.org. The music scene is alive and well at Belltown's Crocodile Cafe. Performances through the month of June include Juliana Hatfield, Mike Doty, and The Slip. For a full music schedule, go to thecrocodile.com. Experience the exuberant career of dance choreographer Trisha Brown at the Henry Art Gallery's exhibit, Trisha Brown, Dance and Art in Dialogue, running now through July 18th. Hours and information is at henryart.org. And finally, a compelling exhibit featuring artists of different races and ethnicities entitled Beyond Talk, Redrawing Race, runs now through December 12th at the Wing Luke Asian Museum. Hours and directions are at wingluke.org. Miss something? Not to worry. Go to seattlechannel.org and click on City A Go Go. Well, that's it for the show this month. Thanks so much for watching. And as always, we encourage you to get out there, try something exotic and new, and experience the awesome power of art. We'll see you next time. Fresh eel head, nothing like it.